Good evening. From 120 Minutes, this is the New Music News. The Mekons have been making new music for most of the past 11 years, and whether it's sounded closer to punk or country and western, Mekons' music has always been laced with left-wing philosophy and a rich sense of irony. The Mekons' new album, Rock and Roll, is chock-a-block full of both. Here's more. a euphemism for sex, and now rock and roll just means cash. The idea of rock music in the first place was this incredible liberating thing that had to happen and it was exciting and it was liberating and now it's kind of the other way around. Now it's a set of useless commodities coming out of a, a pipeline which people feel obliged to buy like they're obliged to buy moistened toilet paper or refrigerators. The Mekons say some provocative things but this year after a dozen years in the business they put their music where their mouth is and wrote an entire LP about the irony of being a rock band who are disgusted by the state of rock and roll. Can you print the lyrics along the bottom and have a little oh, bouncing ball? It's a series, a loosely related series of songs that attempt to deal with our position in the music industry. So rock and roll is not just like a woo yay rock and roll album, it's more like a mm, rock and roll. But would the Mekons like to see other bands take the same approach and write lyrics that question the process that sells rock and roll? I'd rather have people singing adolescent rubbish than people singing sort of hypocritical rock songs about how they think they can change the world and how they're holier than thou. I mean, certain bands have made their total living out of being right on and uh, you know they're extremely rich people and they're really they're up to their necks in care how do they come like to destiny? terms with the contradiction i'd rather see you know people singing baby i love you to be honest it seems more of a straightforward yeah. inane view of what rock music is rather than pretending it's something that's going to change anything okay guys but you have just signed to a major label and you are out there playing message heavy rock and roll just like you too except that you two make a lot more money sounds like there could be some contradiction there. We enjoy music, it's just we also accept that there's a lot about music and the music industry that's not so pleasant. Now it's all like chock full of contradictions and those contradictions are, are not going to disappear and in a way the contradictions can actually be made to be interesting. And it's a rich vein which we chisel away at. Damn communists! John Langford of course is also a member of the Three Johns.